اعوذباللہمنشیطانرجیم بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم گڈ مارننگ لاڈیز اینڈ جنرل جنٹل مین دس از راؤ محمد شعیب کرنٹلی آئی ایم ان پاکستان ان کراچی ایٹ دا مومنٹ آئی ہیو میسج فار دا یورپین ایمبیسی ایمبیسی آف ہنگری اسلام آباد پاکستان ایز ویل ایز آئی ہیو دا میسج فار دی چیف آف آرمی اسٹاف in Islamabad, Pakistan. I'm sending through the Pakistan citizen portal and as well as I'm sending this message to the relevant social media as well. I would like to mention one thing here. First of all, that uh, I came here in Pakistan in favor to, to my mother operation in Pakistan in 2014. I am stuck Afterwards, since seven years at the moment, I am stuck in Pakistan because of the fake judicial system of Pakistan. This is the time that, that I need to come to the social media and uh, extremely explain the situation to the whole, whole world and especially Honorable Embassy of Hungary, Islamabad, Pakistan, because I am tired to send the, the applications to the Pakistan citizen portal. I have already sent more than 127, I, I am not sure about it, more than 100, you can approximately calculate yourself. The issue is that here, that I have the epilepsy patient child in Hungary at the moment, who is special need child I came here for one month in favor for my mom operation. But afterwards, I'm stuck here. Whatever is happening here, I would like to mention the real face of Islami Jamuria in Pakistan, that what is going on here. I have already mentioned several, several videos, several applications to the, on the name of the Chief Justice of Pakistan, Prime Minister of Pakistan, Wazir Ala Murad Ali Shah, who is the chief minister in province Sindh, especially IG Sindh, and other relevant uh, authorities about uh, what, uh, whatever is going on here. I would like to mention one thing. What is going on in our, our judicial system of Sindh? You will be shocked, as I am still shocked, that our courts are selling. I'm a, I apologize if I use any words because I'm not, not, the, not a lawyer, but whatever I'm watching here, this is totally ridiculous. That we are selling the big data stamp papers in Pakistan, in our courts. We are providing the fake slips in our courts. And who is providing the retired judge of the perfect express company, which is in the boundaries of the city court of Karachi. I would like to mention that after that, what is happening after that, the happening is that the thing is happening is that, that people are able to put any fake judicial case, any civil as my situation, any civil suit they have created against my property, which is 35 to 40 million in PKR rupees. What is going on here? And I'm stuck because of that. The case was not in the, judici in the judicial system, or I should say not in the judicial system, in, a, in the axis of the judiciary. This is the perfect word. The case was not in the axis of the judiciary, but it is, comes in the judiciary axis because our judiciary, in the boundaries of the judiciary, the black ships are sitting over there and they are providing the back data stamp papers since 1950 to date as. You can buy any back data stamp paper after 1950 1960, 1955, 
1994, whatever date you have required. And after that, on behalf of that, what is going on? A fake judicial case is created against you or against your property. These are the men cause. That's, that's why I'm here. Because I would like to mention that again and again, that I do not want to stay in Pakistan. I came here because at that time I was thinking that oh, I will meet up my family, my relatives, my friends. But what I see here, this is purely animal lady scenario in Pakistan, whatever I'm watching here. And that's what I'm trying to mention to the above authorities of Pakistan and, and the European authorities that kindly let me out from Pakistan. And uh, I want to stay with my, with my son. I have already dispute with my wife because of my, because of my, I have already dispute with my wife, European wife because of the judicial system of Pakistan. And the ridiculous system, since five years, Pakistan citizen portal, prime minister portal, I'm, I sent all bundles of, bundles of applications. I sent to the relevant police, law and order agency, law and order agencies such as uh, SSP, such as SHO, relevant SHO, but nothing is useful in this country because totally corrupt environment we have in Pakistan. If you need to get justice, you will have to pay the money to the, in the courts. If you need to made, make any FIR, you will have to pay money to the local police. And after that, the case will be registered. These are the situation in Pakistan. But what I need to do, anybody will let me know what is my fault here. I came here for one month. I am here since seven years. Who is responsible for that? Who is, who are those people who are accepting these cases in the judiciary? Although even they are selling, they are creating the case their own choice, on their own choice. What I need to do? And the cases are here. It usually take five to 50 years in Pakistan. It doesn't matter. It is fake or, or it is real case. But my, my, my issue is that, my problem is that I wanted to inform to the local authorities Pakistani authorities, I tried a bundle of time to mention them that please check it out and investigate because land mafias are very, in, they are very, they are, they are in powers because they are giving the money to everyone. But the ground realities are totally different here. That's what I'm trying to mention that. I already mentioned on several occasions that uh, this is not the case in the, in the, if you check it out, because I, I lived in Europe for, for many years and I, I know that very well, that this kind of ridiculous system or whatever is going on in our tradition judicial system or in the, in the in the boundaries of the courts is totally against of the humanity against of the religious grounds against of everything this is not the fair thing in pakistan there are 21 more than 21 lakhs case cases are registered how many are real cases these are the question mark because the Chief Justice of Pakistan, does he know that? And definitely, he will know that in our courts, what is going on. Anyone can buy the stamp papers, anyone can create the, the fake slips. 
if I paid the money to the perfect courier whose owner is the retired judge, they already alive my mad, my my dad my, my passed away mother, who was dead, who was passed away in Canada, which is already was which was already in the record of the case civil nature case in 1856 of 2016. So it is very interesting that everything is creating in the court and then accepting the court court matters in the same in the same boundary. These are the problems here. A normal citizen cannot get justice in Pakistan. That's, that is why the judiciary is going. If you check it out, the rank of corruption in our judiciary, it is 128 numbers out of 156 or I'm not sure about it. But it is huge ratio of corruption in our judiciary. What I am watching here, that's why I do not want to stay here. I want to, to go back. I would like to appeal to the chief of army staff because I made already a bundle of time to the prime minister portal for prime minister. I requested, I requested to the chief minister, chief minister. I requested to the chief justice of Pakistan, but there is no solution. There, there is no authority to check it out. What I'm saying. I'm simply mentioning that I am staying without any reason. This is not the case. This case is creating by yourself in our local courts and every courts doing that things. That's why I'm mentioning to the all authorities, please stand for appropriate justice and made some kind of implementation in our laws, short reforms, made lawful criteria in our judiciaries. How it is happening? Check it out. My cell phone number is 03152411761. My, my CNIC number 4220108508958-5. If you have any query about it, you may call me or send me. I can send you the video records as well. I have all the evidences that what is going on in the in the our in our judiciary. I have already sent the documentations that how in in the boundaries of our courts how people made alive my mother who was passed away two years ago. This is the case, which is which was not the case, but it is still a case. And I am not able to move out until it is sorted out. My life is in danger. I'm not able to move back. So this is why I am approaching to the social media and entire authorities of Pakistan and the European European Union authorities. Especially, I will request to the Embassy of Hungary about it that kindly check it out my my matter and and struggle for that that I can able to move back to Hungary where my special need child is reside at the moment since five years who is complaining me as well that every papa came to school to pick up their childs but I am not able my papa doesn't come at all. What I need to do? Will I, anybody will let me know that? That's all. Thank you very much. Pak Coach Zindabad. Pakistan Zindabad. That's it. Allah Nigiban. Allah Hafiz.